week's ASFN News Flash. And guys, this week is the last week that you can vote for your favorite catches on the News Flash. And by the end of next week, we will announce the winners for October. And those winners will receive either ASFN shirt or a Suzuki shirt based on the best voted bass catch, the best voted offshore catch, and the best voted rock and surf catch so guys please keep on supporting your fellow anglers keep on voting and remember to send your catch to my catch at azfn.co.za that is my catch at azfn.co.za and like i said earlier the winners will be announced next week please also remember to subscribe to the channel and to hit that little bell icon for notifications of when new content is getting loaded please remember to like the videos that really helps us to keep on going but without further ado let's get right into this week's asfn news flash our first catch this week is from josh meyer very familiar face on the asfn news flash and he caught two beautiful bass he also sent in a catch from his friend Rock Nietling, who also caught a bass. Then Duran with a four kilogram Gary that he caught on the south coast of Kuzuru Natal. Best of it all, this fish was safely released. He caught it using his Torium 13 and his Poseidon rod. Leonardo and his friends went off to a trip at Chizini Dam and caught some stunning tigers ranging from 1.4 kilograms to 3.1 kilograms. Leon went out with Tony from Tiger Safaris. Leon also asked us to make a special mention of the tour guides and the charters in the industry and that we must please try and support these guys because they did take a knock during the pandemic. Then Aaron caught a beautiful cob at Nintanzini that's on the north coast of KwaZulu Natal. He used his Assassin Zero medium heavy, his Tala 10,000 and 30 pound JDB braid. He used a Chaka prawn bait to catch this beautiful cob. Then he also sent in a three spot pompana, also known as a large spot pompana, or a wave carrick that he caught at Cape Vital St. Lucia area. He caught this fish using a Chaka red eye combo bait, and he was using his Assassin Beach Master and his Conflict 3000. Then a couple of catches from Nuvesh, who caught a monster barbel at the Val River. He also managed to catch a yellow fish at Fox Rest. Then a 3.1 kilogram bass that he caught at Vistogram, and that is in Fox Rest. Congratulations on these great catches, and all these fish were safely released. Baruk Onya caught a nine kilogram cob and this was at Strace by Plot. He was using a chocobait, his Poseidon rod and his Dawa Saltus BG 40H. Then Andre with a 207 centimeter bronze water shark that he caught at St. Francis and this was on a fro bait. Bilal amongst all the bad weather we've been having the last couple of weeks caught this grey shark. And then the last catch for this week, a spectacular once in a lifetime catch for Buta Rodemeyer who caught this high 179 centimeter that is an 80 kilogram cow shark he was using a yellow tail head a venom medusa rod and a pen slammer 8500 this fish was tagged and released well that wraps it up for this week's asfn news flash guys please remember to vote for all the anglers this is your last time to vote for the anglers you can also go back on the old videos if you still haven't voted for previous catches and previous videos please go and vote support your fellow anglers and by next week we will announce the winners for the asfn shirt and the two suzuki shirts guys we thank you for watching and please keep those catches coming to my catch at azofen.co.za that is my catch at azofen.co.za also remember to like the videos that really helps us guys and to subscribe to the channel and to hit that little bell icon if you would like notifications of when we upload new content we'll see you next time goodbye